houses away from my kids. I just love them so much. And maybe can. Hello, everyone. My name is Presenter Ali, and today I'm joined by one lady who I'm sure you guys have seen her video actually going viral. This is after she was actually flying to Kenya. Her name is uh, Rosalind Atieno, and she's actually from Kenya. And uh, she was working in Lebanon where she left the other day, and the kids were crying. And the video went very viral, and the lady became an internet sensation. I'm here to talk to her. Let's uh, let us uh, get to know her and also get to know her story. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Maybe, maybe you can introduce yourself. My name is Rosaline Atieno Oyola mm -hmm. from Sierra okay. County, Bondo District, a sublocation, subdivision, yes. uh, a place called Asembo Kanyigor. So uh, when did you get to go to Lebanon? I went to Lebanon 2021, 20, October. Yeah. Uh, why did you decide first to go to Lebanon? There are many places that many people, you know, normally go. And uh, was it to search for green, greener pastures? And maybe what was happening in your life that time when you decided to go to Lebanon? Okay, I was in uh, uh, marriage, mm -hmm. and after it was not working out, so I decided to go to to look for a greener pasture to be able to stabilize the life of my kids. Yeah. How many kids do you have? I have three kids, two boys and one girl. How old are they? Mm, first born, 13 years, second born, six years, and third born, four years. Yeah. Many people uh, normally are, are scared of going to the Gulf because of the negative stories that we get. Uh, on your side, before going to Lebanon, were you scared in any way? Yes, I was, but I was praying so hard to get a house that has those people with kind heart. And luckily God answered my prayers. Amazing. How was your first experience the first day, the very first day they came to pick you at the airport, uh, the, the, your first interaction with them? Tell us a little bit about it. Uh, the only word that my, my boss said to me the first day was just wow. That one, that is the, the word she told me. We blended the first day until the last time. Mm -hmm. Because uh, from the video, you can actually tell that they are good people. Tell us a little bit more about them. They're just a good family. That is all I can say. They're good people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They also happen actually to be uh, an internet sensation. They also happen to be celebrities in a way. While working with them, uh, how, how, how was it uh, in terms of working with people who are popular in Lebanon? Everything was just normal. You couldn't realize that they are that famous. It was just normal. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Did you get also to do content with them in a way? No, no, not really. No, maybe just a few videos, maybe something like maybe the kids are coming, we are playing, and they will take some videos. Yeah, just like that. On the videos, uh, uh, on, the, on the training video, it was actually very emotional. You were crying, the kids were crying. Uh, tell us a little bit about that moment. That moment was the saddest moment in my life, filled with mixed feelings. Because on the other hand, I was happy coming to meet my family. And, uh, and on the other hand, I was feeling sad because I'm leaving the kids that I've been living with the Two, for two years, and they they were treating me as their parent. They you even called you mom. Yes. How, how did how did it feel? Did it feel like you were home? You know, when your kids are away, but you have kids right here who are calling you mom. Yeah, there I felt like home. In fact, I felt like I'm at home. Yeah. Okay. The only difference is what it was that I'm being paid. That was the difference, but it was just like home. Yeah. What do you love about the kids? I love them because they they appreciate my work and they love me for who I am. That's why I love them. Yeah. One of the things that you actually happen to mention is the fact that, you know, even after leaving uh, Lebanon, you are going to go back. Have you decided when to, when to go back? No, I just know that I'm going back, but I've not set the date yet. Is the family aware that right now you are an internet sensation? Everyone right here in Africa is looking for you. Yes, they are aware. What do they say? They are just happy for me. Yeah. Okay. Mm. What message do you have for them if they are watching this video? I love them so much and I appreciate them very, very much. And 
uh, I just wish they never change, even if they, they have other fellow, fellow Africans working in their houses, they should just treat them the way they treated me. Yeah. Now that you are here in Kenya, uh, what projects are you embarking on? Um, for now, I have a business. I'm handling a business in town. Uh, yeah. Many people uh, who watch uh, or who know Kenyans sometimes may be scared of employing them because maybe they know Kenyans might be, some Kenyans might be rude, some Kenyans might be lazy, but you've actually changed the whole narrative in that people are seeing that Kenyans are very lovable people, they're very hospitable people. What should you tell any employer who's watching this video right now? That they should not have that uh, negative mind that all are bad. And they should just treat each other, uh, workers good, uh, yeah. And what, what would you also tell, you know, the Kenyans who are working abroad? They should just uh, do their work up good and pray, that is all I can say. Wow. Tell us about the deal that you've actually landed uh, with uh, Expeditions Masai Safari. Uh, first, I would like to appreciate them for they have offered me a trip with my family. I just say thank you so much. Yeah. Is this your first trip since you came? No, I've been into several trips, but this is different because it's not me who is. Who's paying? Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What message now do you have to your kids? Of course, they've seen you trending. I'm sure they are somehow confused. It looks like it's overwhelming to you, Pia. The message I have is that I love them very much and I can go to any height to make the ends meet for them and to make them live a good life. Yeah. Maybe do, do, do you look at yourself, you know, going back to, 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 to the marriage that probably never worked? No. Has, has the ex-husband seen you trending? Has, she, has he tried to reach out? No, I don't know. You don't know? You're, you're getting many DMs right now. Yeah. How is it for you? I've not, yani, I've not considered them to be special because I'm not there yet. I don't want to focus on that yet. So when, you, when you're going back to Lebanon, do you, are you going to work or are you just going to say hi to them? I will work with them for, uh, for some. Maybe I'll see what to do, but I will have to be there for the kids at least for them to grow a bit because they are really suffering. Talk to the kids. I'm sure they'll watch this. Maria and Katie, Mama Rosie loves you very much. And I miss you very much. <laughs> what do you miss about them? I just miss the way I used to treat them. They, they made me not to miss my kids so much. They, they filled that emptiness that I was feeling when I was out away from my kids. <laughs> I just love them so much. And maybe can you can you can you speak to them in in Lebanese or in Arabic? Rosi Habak Ktir. Thank you so much for coming. Uh, it looks like you, you really had a special bond with them. Would you, like, would you like them to come to Kenya maybe one day and see where you live, see how you've been living? Yes, I would love them to come and meet my kids also. Wow. Thank you so much uh, for, for giving us this opportunity. Uh, maybe your last words to the world, anyone watching in this world. Of course, you've actually proven that you know there is love out there, there is genuine love out there, and you've really, really uh, risen the Kenyan flag to show people that you know Kenyans are good people. So talk to anyone who's watching this from anywhere in the world. That let's keep on spreading humanity and let's spread love. If you work with anyone, just do good. Just be, be humble and be just lovable, that is. Thank you so much for coming. Nimekuwa uh, nikizungumza na Rosalyn Atieno, one of the most viral people right now here in the world. She actually uh, just got a deal with Expeditions Masai Safaris. Congratulations on that. And maybe, are you looking forward to working with maybe other brands if they come on board? Yes, yes. What would you like to tell them? <laughs> yes. 
Mm. Amazing sana. Paul Cross Kadema, the CEO of Expeditions Masai Safaris. Uh, today is a great day that uh, we have received Rosie in our offices. She has been uh, trending worldwide. Now, as a company, what we do, the people who are doing great things in the society, we always reward them. So we decided to reward Rosie with what we do. That is a, a holiday package for her and the family. So today is a great day because Rosie, she has been uh, away. Uh, she has been away uh, in Lebanon working very hard uh, for our, her family here in Kenya. And when Mutuana Rudi Nyumbani, most times even the people who are in diaspora, they go for holidays. So that is a reward that Tuliona CC Kama Kampuni in Amfasana. Because you get that uh, most times from the Gulf, we get very bad news, uh, negative news. But whenever we can see that Kuna uh, Mschana Wetu Kutoka Hapa Kenya, who is setting a good example there in Gulf. I came in when I saw that video, it touched me, and I decided to give to her. Uh, thank you very much. My name is Joseph. I'm the marketing manager here at Expeditions Massai Safaris. And Expeditions Massai Safaris is a brand. We believe in encouraging people who are going out of their way, people who are doing their work passionately, people who are impacting the community in a very positive way. As you can see, we are a very... Uh, we are a company of young people and there is no better way to give back to the community as a business than uh, ensuring that we are sharing the joy with those people out there who are impacting our society. So this is part of our uh, strategic plan and we, we will always be there to reward people who are doing incredible things for the community, people who are uh, um, making uniting Kenyans in positive ways. For instance, Rosa has united the country, has shown uh, the world what Kenyan workers all over the world are made of. Kenyan workers are very hardworking, they are very passionate, they are very respectful, and they do their work with a whole heart. So we are rewarding Rosa and we'll continue to reward other people who come out and showcase Kenya in a very positive, positive light. Uh, at Expeditions Maasai Safaris, we have incredible holiday offers for both local and international market. Uh, locally, we do the best of beach safaris. We are talking of Mombasa packages, Diani, Watamu. And if you want to experience the best safari in Kenya, Expeditions Maasai Safaris will take you across Kenya to the Maasai Mara to see the Big Five, the wildebeest migration. We'll take you to Amboseli to have incredible views of the largest mount, mountain in, in Africa, Mount Kilimanjaro and you'll see the jumbos, the elephants. If you want to go to Savo, you want to go to um, Samburu, we have the best uh, combination of both bush and beach safaris. When you want to go outside the country, maybe you want to take your, uh, your family to a city like Dubai, you want to go to Europe, you want to go to Mauritius, we have the best, the best holiday packages for you. And I would like to remind Kenyans, South Africa is now visa free for Kenyan passport holders. We have unbeatable deals for anyone who wants to travel to South Africa. We have the best deals for Cape Town, Cape Town and Johannesburg combined. Reach out to us and we'll take very good care of you. Initial presenter Ali, your entertainment PA. The A is always for amazing big shout out to the team behind the camera. The leader is Frank, the director. I'll see you guys in the next video. I would like to thank you, uh, our um, supporters online, and especially the people on social media, because every time that we come to you that you are looking for these people who are trending or the people who are doing some great things in the society, you always uh, give us the numbers and uh, you, make, uh, you make them come to Expeditions Masai Safari so that we can be able to reward them. So I take these opportunities to say thank you and also to welcome the international guests like uh, the Rosie's boss and uh, other peoples who are around the world who are following this story. You are welcome to Kenya. We have great offers. Migration is happening next year. So you can come to Expeditions Masai Safari, start booking early so that we can be able to, to show you what Kenya has to offer. Asante sana.